Harding University right-hander Alex Smith took to the mound Tuesday against Lyon College. On a day that saw temperatures in the high 70s, both teams had to battle winds that reached 25 miles an hour during game one of the doubleheader. Alex Smith went three strong innings giving up no runs and only allowing one man to reach base when a ball got away from him on a 2-2 count that struck designated hitter Michael Armenteros. The Bisons took a 2-0 lead entering the fifth inning. However, the bats of the Scots couldn't be silenced for long. With the bases loaded, junior Michael Armenteros singled up the middle, putting the Scots on the scoreboard. Lyon College would go on to score two more runs in the inning, one of which came off the bat of right fielder Corey Ford, who extended his hitting streak to 19 straight games. The Bisons' pitching woes continued, giving up six runs over the final two innings. Lyon third baseman Aaron Thornton finished the day two for three, following a three-run shot that gave the Scots a seven-run lead entering the final inning. Despite the late inning efforts of Bison Jason Nappy, who hit a two-run homer to opposite field in the bottom of the seventh, the insurance runs of the Scots were enough to give pitcher Tim Weeks his first victory of the season. Weeks went six innings, giving up only two runs on six Bison hits. Although Weeks struggled at times walking four batters, his three strikeouts were enough to hand the Bisons their 19th loss of the season. With the 9-5 victory, Lyon College improved to 21-10 overall. The Bisons fell to 500 on the year and fifth in the West Division of the Gulf South Conference. The Bisons did manage to split the doubleheader with a 7-6 victory following a game-winning sacrifice fly by freshman Paul Anzalone in the bottom of the seventh. The Bisons now travel to Arkadelphia to take on conference opponent Henderson State in another doubleheader this Saturday. Reporting for TV16 News, I'm Grant Sloan.